Incoming transmission standby, welcome to the Nod News Network. U.S. mortgage rates reach to 23-year high. The housing market is in dire need of attention, according to economists. After the Federal Reserve's vigorous push to raise interest rates, American house loan rates soared to their highest level in more than two decades, edging close to 8% this week. According to information from Mortgage News Daily, the average 30-year fixed mortgage rate hit 7.49% on Tuesday for the first time since late 2000, placing pressure on the post-COVID housing market. According to the Mortgage Bankers Association, house purchase applications decreased for a sixth week, reaching their lowest level since 1995 as growing costs made homeownership more and more out of reach for many Americans. According to James Iorio, Managing Director of TJM Institutional Services, as time goes on and people have to pay off those 30-year loans that they have, I think we're going to see the effects in housing are going to be dire, but it's going to take longer this time than before. The 10-year U.S. Treasury bond yield, which affects mortgage rates and other borrowing costs, is currently at or around 16-year highs as traders increasingly anticipate higher rates for a longer period of time. According to Bloomberg, the majority of U.S. authorities continue to foresee strong inflationary upside risks that could need more rate increases. According to the publication, the residential housing market would be put under further strain as a result of growing borrowing prices and high mortgage rates. As owners refrained from selling because they were locked into low-interest mortgages, home sales fell in July. In July 2022 compared to July 2018, there were 16.6% fewer sales of previously owned homes, according to National Association of Realtors data. In 1981, when the annual average was 16.63%, U.S. mortgage rates were at their highest ever level. This has been the Nod News Network, transmission complete.